What is up guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys today we're gonna to be pulling soul stones we got 212 mortal 13 immortal and two eternals so i think this is about three or four months of saving and um, there was two events so the first one i was a little bit low on resources so i skipped it and then there was like a, a winter's path or some sort of event and it just wasn't worth it so we skipped that one as well so that's how we've managed to get so stacked as free to play and let's just go for it, boys. Hopefully, we get something really, really juicy. No horn, obviously great for um, Shogun. Like, absolutely god tier for that. But two stars isn't going to do too much. Uh, Siege Hulk is pretty useful for this rotation of Curse City. So definitely worth holding on to that one. And I'm going to start holding on to more. If they're sort of four, four and above for Epics, I'm definitely could be holding on to them just because they're so much more valuable now and it depends like you know jar reg he's an also like an awesome champion so i'll definitely hold on to two of those so any sort of champion that i feel that you know uh, oh mythical <laughs> mezzle is a one star if i've already got a copy i'm gonna sell it but yeah so like that apothecary four star as well very very nice definitely worth holding on to uh, but yeah, so if it's like four star and above, I'll probably keep it. Um, and for Epic, say it's like three or two stars and it's a really good champion. And um, then I will hold on to it. Like a really old school champion that I think a lot of people sleep on is like um, Miscreated Monster. He's sort of a forgotten hero. Absolute beast. Double mythical. Androx and a legendary. <laughs> and it's Eva. So Eva, not so hot. Just a great campaign farmer. Adrox kind of new. I don't know too much about him, to be honest. Um, but he's mythical. I'll probably never get him, so there's not much, you know, no point worrying about it too much. Garrel is an absolute beast in Arena, but again, when you're free to play, you're probably not going to be getting many mythicals. Uh, <laughs> Ger Gerard. Love Gerard. Um, he's not great, but he's just a hard hitting uh, single target uh epic so uh, yeah really really like him acrisia game changing void legendary amazing for hydra can just blow up any boss in pretty much any pve content but i don't have her so nothing too excited to at the moment frozen banshee five star that is definitely worth holding on to and i need to make some space be right back so down to 150 let's go boys Okay, another null horn. Oh, nothing but trash. Okay, let's keep going. 120 points. Legendary. It's Vlad. A four star on Vlad. So I don't think he's an amazing champion. He's pretty decent for Arena. Um, there's two ways to build him. You can either go full DPS or support. And I've gone for support on mine because he does throw out a lot of debuffs. But yeah, he's, he's an okay champion. Husk, obviously great for Hydra. Uh, but one star, definitely going to sell it. Uh, Rocktooth, I think, is a pretty decent champion. Uh, brings a heal reduction. Uh, can be really useful early on if you're struggling with uh, Spirit. I can't remember what it's called. I, uh, what uh, Where you get Potion Keeps, Spirit Potion Keep. I have not farmed a potion keep in like a year, maybe even two years now. Oh, guys. Okay, Godseeker Neri, that is great. Eurogrim, another great champion. Um, so yeah, obviously Godseeker, she is just, um, like so, you can get so much value out of her. Um, Clan Boss, Sand Devil, uh, literally like almost every piece of content you can find some sort of use for her okay and again we're out of space 92 to go come on guys let's try and get at least a legendary that we'd really want for the account uh, spider a great champion really underrated uh, he brings um, drop defense aoe 
Um, Sunisha as well, really big fan of Sunisha. Um, hits super hard, pairs up really nicely with Skull Crown. But yeah, hits really hard on the A1, and it's an AoE here as well. Legendary. Sun Wukong. Uh, so my Wukong is already fully maxed. Angar, I don't have. But if I do pull a second Wukong, definitely uh, be holding on to that. Wukong, such a game-changing champion. <laughs> Laburga. So I don't know too much about this champion, but I've seen people using it in Kersi, so I will hold on to that one. 15,000 points. This has got to be a big one. Okay, legendary. <laughs> one star Lady Kimmy. Frolin. <laughs> I don't have him. I don't think I will ever get him. But you never know. Oh man, that sucks, guys. And it looks like we're probably not going to get anything that's going to help progress the account. So guys, we've actually already got a five-star Frolin as well. So yeah, we're going to sell that. Sell that Wukong as well. Quickly pop down here and literally just going to go on a selling spree. And we are literally only keeping the best stuff for the account. All of this is just trash. But yeah, there's a few champions that might pay off just for Cursey. But outside of that, it's all getting sold. Yeah, that looks pretty good to me. All right, let's, let's hop back into it. Okay, 42 to go. Jorg, not too bad. <laughs> Vassal, don't have him. Okay, <laughs> pretty much all trash for me. God, soul, pulling soul stones is just the worst. Again, looks like we're not really getting much. Like Sky, Sky Touch Shaman, great champion. Um, you know, brings uh, revive on death and cleanses as well. Okay, Skull Crown, one of the OGs. Uh, definitely feel like she's fallen off for Arena, but she's still pretty decent, especially for early and, and mid Arena. Cordan, um, yeah, I do need that one. But yeah, it's not what one star is not going to make a huge amount of difference. Isabel, pretty cool bomb champion. I'm going to be using her. Oh, Direct star. Oh man, it's only one star though. But he is one of the one of the OGs. Amazing for so much content in the game. Doom Tower bosses, like literally, he could probably do like nine out of twelve. Just an absolute beast. Let's just see. Okay, we've got enough space. Let's just go hard and just pull Immortal Soul Stones. Here we go, boys. Grush. Nice. Decent, decent champion. Mythical. Synchrod. Don't have. Lockwan. Pretty decent. And Frolin again. Why are they obsessed with giving me Frolin? Oh, I just, they really need to sort of change the rates, man. Like, the mythicals, I'm sure you get more mythicals than you do legendaries. It's just so unbalanced. Mythical again. Uh, Mezzle, never see her on my account. Oh, nice. Shamuel, I'm going to be doing a guide on him soon. Like, obviously, god tier when it comes to Hydra, an absolute beast. Um, also really good for Doom Tower as well. He can just one-shot pretty much anything. It's legendary. Ali. Oh, sorry, Alil. I don't have him. Oh, my God. And it's five stars as well. Oh. Okay, and Taurus, actually 
five star Taurus. That is such, that is a good pull. Taurus is actually a really good champion. If you've got poison explosions on your account, you want to bring him in. Um, so let's just have a look uh, at the soul merchant quickly. So we can buy five of those. I'm not going to blow those now. And this is what we want to be buying. You want to be buying the, the jam tarts. Do not make the mistake that I did and get the Immortal Soul Stone or Eternal Soul Stone. It's going to slow down your progression. The, seriously, like the best way to get champions in the game is from the shop. Pretty much, this is where you're going to have to go if you want to empower your champions. And let's just see where we are in Soul Chase. So I did quickly hop on before and get most of the rewards, but we've got a comfortable lead. I don't think I'm going to be first place for this, but hopefully we can get that legendary book and, you know, six pieces of legendary uh, relentless gear would be pretty nice as well. But yeah, and while we're at, let's just pull. Oh, we'd have enough. All right, we're five off. Let's forget about it then. But anyway, thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you have better luck than me. Like, literally, I didn't think I got anything that's really going to help the account, especially for Curse C. But yeah, better luck with for you guys, seriously. Uh, please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure you smash, smash, smash that subscribe. And I'll see you all in a video soon. Peace!